Afambo ngazi chawa. Afadi mbuche kube chawa. Abu moyana mbra states. Ana numde nubu states. Ejira mzayo lewu ewu. Iye zayo mbe golu merika. Manadima ana heo kwe meso. Since 2019, a health issue is yeah, yeah, so dangerous. On my affairs in our heart. And they treat you, and they treat you, and they drugs upon drugs. But as I'm telling you now, the other one are bigger affected. Nasia Kaiga Zion, Kaiga Crusade. In your live oil, I'll take you to Ochi Osum Nozugo. I'll see you now, and I'm going to fully be able to this year. Nsi <laughs> Ne follow kwa Zion. Now see God of Zion. Owe we him and me. He command the, this man to be a Zion. Owe raw power. Nlo nlo fu daddy nlo nlo. I say madam, go and bring your husband. Nse ane ebuka squa mo bota ge bi aka ije. I say mke ambasa ige ije. Nse a mo bo na opa dote. Ungwa next week. Next week or two earlier. Nse a no mommy ana kwa school. Owe ro yenga ra porundo bere. Net the wow. I found that in a leg again. Madam, go and bring your husband. I think I'm a sire, just see a young cagalaga. I see Moke or Tialia. Twenty second. Daddy locates here. Dim. There is one big man in Abuja. I won't call your names, but this prophecy that we know that the Lord is speaking to them is of Igbo, Igbo man, a big man. There are something happening to them, happening to the man. He is dying slowly, physically, psychologically, all around, both the business, both health. The wife had been telling him, come, let's see Brother Ebuka. Hey, how can I go there? How can I see him? How can, how can, how can? You are deliberating. I see when they will bring him. That time is already late. Oh, he's a big man. Oh, no, Abuja. The wife watched this program all the time. The, wa the wife, been, let's go and see him. Let's go and see him. Let's go and see him. What everybody needs in this world, whether you are rich, whether you are poor, whether you are a professor, what you cannot ignore is that there is a spiritual and the spiritual control the physical you must not ignore the existence of god that young man in abuja i see you being disgraced if you don't come god is speaking to you through your wife pay attention to her before it is too late may the mercy of god come upon you amen. may you not die amen. may you be healed of your internal sickness amen. and may your business may the arrows go about the sender amen. may the lord intervene in your case amen. in the name of J E S U S C. daddy god of zion god of zion daddy last night kadi on I book a flight last night as soon as we chance. If not, as if God up on the go up on the up on pico. Seven children can come as soon as we have a girl book a mom. Here in the preach at that side of the house, I say, "Be daddy, give me a walk away." I'm not making a god of Zion. In case you get to move, you don't know. Where is the fellow girl? My on a roll. Big man, are you the one that your wife is talking to and you refuse to answer her? Huh? Eh? Yes, daddy. Yes, daddy. Aging a woman, they want to go. Eh? Eh? Now you get money past everybody. No. So why is your wife telling you to come? You, you never want to come. Why? Why were you disobeying her? God can speak to you through your wife. Eh? Now so, 
Ubu aqui mano nasceu. Woman, did you? Have I seen you before? No, daddy. Have me and you talk before? No, daddy. Last year in This year the prophecy mentioned exactly you have been telling listening to your wife dinge kwa abelas ya o sono mba ye jidi mo state next year e obia onwo when death is looking for somebody is like a magnet you never listen to your wife last year this year buri mo state i can hear next year ke na akwado you will leave Sometimes, sometimes it will be as if she will, he will not even see the next day. I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. God will perfect everything that concerns. Uh, next time, listen to your wife. That is why she's your wife. Thank you, daddy. Huh? Thank you, daddy. Oh, big man, one of who come, daddy. He lonely, hungry. Every white, now fun do young wolau, now future wun your father. Ever had in It will not happen again. He cared in a prophecy. Receive your healing from this altar in Jesus' holy name. Amen. And God will restore everything you have lost. Because if your business is crashing down, do you hear the prophecy? I told him that he will be disgraced. Some of his money is in the hands of people. Yes, that. And. Oh, yeah, behind Hanuk. One big man. Everything now fall apart. We are going to say, I don't know, I'm going to find a bank. Eh? Because when something is holding you, you will never know where you go. Your business is falling down. You are seeing where you die. And your wife is telling you about your material furniture. You say no. Today, your yoke is broken. Amen. In Jesus' holy name. Amen.